Where to even begin with this video? I guess we'll start at the beginning. Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be one of my most exciting vlogs ever. You guys know I love a travel vlog and we are going to one of my top tier bucket list destinations and that is Mykonos. I'm so excited. Mykonos is in Greece and it promises blue skies and even bluer seas. But let's just rewind it back a little bit because I first got invited about five months ago. I've been looking forward to this for five months and I got the email through from Caudalie, which is one of my favorite skincare brands that we were going to go to the Mykonos Beach Club. And obviously, naturally, I played it cool and I took a whole two seconds to respond with an immediate yes. And to make this trip even more exciting we decided to add on a little girls trip for me and chloe as well as a full pinch me moment where we've ended up inviting with karen millen and like to know it for the last half of the trip i really hope you enjoy this video it's one of my absolute favorites and it's been an absolute pleasure to take you guys along with me and yeah let's get into it so exciting but I might have to close it just because I'm pretty sure it's bug hour so let me close these just now but look how smooth that is is that not lovely let me give you just a little 360 of the room this is probably the most beautiful room I have ever ever stayed in I feel like I've already made a mess I can't I can't lie I've got my luggage just all the way over there and all my belongings here and everything but look how cute is this dear mrs hales walker that is still so weird for me to see uh may your stay be relaxing joyful and memorable for a lifetime so sweet and that's the nomad team and you can see their instagram there as well if you ever want to have a little look for yourself i look a little bit worse for wear i've just been traveling but today's outfit you've got the arquette linen blazer this is brand new and i love it massimo duty little like racer vest i guess and then these trousers are from for never new because for never new they do petite lengths now, which is perfect. You know what? I've decided I'm not going to fully unpack. I've just got my accessories and my bags and some sandals, but I'm not going to fully unpack because I just think we're not here long enough. And we've got another couple of stops on this trip. So, and there's no rails. So I'm just going to keep it as is and each night think about what it is I need to wear and I'll bring it back out. So we've got about two hours to relax unpack everything like that you guys know i'm an unpacker and then freshen up and get ready for dinner tonight we're having dinner at the hotel which will be lovely i um, need to get my outfit out in case it's a bit crushed um but i'm so excited to be here i've never been to mykonos before and it's absolutely been on my wish list so very excited to be here with caudalie for a couple of days and can't wait to take you guys with me let's go And we're back. Um, yeah, I feel like I just got ready in record speed. Um, the first night is a little bit more chilled. We're having dinner at the hotel. But Chloe came around and we had a few Aperols just out on my little light like, patio. But now, I got ready in time, just. So she's gonna come around, we're gonna try and get a little TikTok if we can, depending on time. Um, but yeah, I feel like I got ready so quick. I don't know what the vibe is. I don't know if the girls are dressing up or not. So I've gone for my fail safe. I've gone for a white blazer and a white skirt from Zara. And then I always just add accessories. Like I said, I'm my accessories era, to be honest. Um, but I'm so excited for tonight. I always feel like the first night is so fun because everyone's just so full of excitement and full of anticipation for the day. Um, but I do, I'm really happy with my makeup. I'm using the new Fenty Beauty bronze liner and I feel like it's really brought the look together with some like rosy blush but I'll see if I can show you my outfit properly. This is the skirt from Zara. I think it's so pretty. It's like this crinkled cheesecloth fabric. I think the two together look so smart and I've just got my big earrings from Freena Hearts on and a little Astro Miu shell necklace and we're just gonna see if this fits 
the vibe of the girls but I love this blazer from ASOS it was such a good find because it's got very exaggerated shoulders but then it's really like nipped in at the waist which I think gives it a premium look and I've got this clutch this raffia clutch bag from next which I actually love so I feel like this is such a good little option to put everything I need in tonight and it's daytime appropriate but it's really good for evening such a good holiday essential so that's the look <laughs> You know it is a special morning indeed when the Caudley girls have left you a delightful little parcel. Um, I'm so excited to have a look what's inside. Let's see the little note. It says, hello Chloe, welcome to the Caudley Beach Club. We are so excited to spend the next few days having fun in the Vino Sun with you. Love Mel and Amy. Clever girls love it. So, so sweet. I love these little handwritten notes. They really make all difference. Oh, yes. If you know, you know. These are the best crisps ever. I cannot wait. I'm going to have a bath. You can see it currently. You can probably hear it currently running. And this just looks divine. But I think we might have some cordially goodies. Oh wow, we have a lot. Oh my gosh, okay. This is perfect, I'm gonna use this just now. Oh my gosh, the shower gel. This is so lovely and again, it is so gentle on your skin. And this is all of our sunscreen. Oh my God, perfect. And I think this is the, yeah, the face sunscreen, which is amazing. You guys know I use this anyway. So I'm gonna put this over to my vanity so I remember to use this. Factor 50, yes. Oh my God, I love this stuff. Because it's an oil, it's so lightweight for a Factor 50. Normally Factor, factor 50 is like a thick, heavy cream um, or they feel heavy on the skin. This doesn't and I need Factor 50 because I'm so pale. It is the 50 plus Vino Sun Protect and it's like in a stick form, invisible protection. And I am so excited. I feel like I've seen a lot of people um, throw this in their handbags because it's just like the perfect size and I'm gonna be I actually am gonna test this out on my face today and because I know that that face cream works I want to see what this is like on the face too look how good this breakfast looks I got myself a little flat white which I can't wait I also love I don't know Greece just know how to do it. Like, that is aesthetic. I love it. But I did get myself a hot coffee. I don't know what it is. I like having iced coffee in the afternoon, but in the morning I need to have a bit of a hot coffee. I've got a nice little fruit bowl here. I decided to get the banana and cinnamon porridge, which actually looks incredible. And then there's some croissants too, and some fresh orange, which I never normally drink, but on holiday, the fresh orange is just so good. My goodness, is it not a beautiful morning? I cannot believe it. As we've just seen, I just sat outside and had some breakfast out on my patio area, and it was 27 degrees. It's 27 degrees outside, and it's not even 10 a.m. The heat here is unlike anything I've ever experienced. I totally understand now why people come here for their holidays. It is that straight, as soon as you come off the airplane, humidity, warmth, it's just. I decided to just go all out on the accessories today. This necklace here, let me bring you in. This necklace here is from a brand called Bialona and it's so beautiful. I'm absolutely obsessed, I just love it. 
and it's giving mermaid vibes and then these earrings i had in my last vlog in sorrento just from amazon i absolutely love them i'm gonna wear my hat also to jazz up a bit of a beach dress because a beach dress can be a bit boring i've added this leather belt from arquette and this little seashell belt from asos again just easy to wear bits i think that just help jazz everything up but love it i'm just gonna get my bag together get everything sorted and head off to meet the girls to go to the beach club morning of content session i always feel like whenever i'm going to somewhere beautiful the first day i just go content mad you really do. i do and then i just tire myself out too much too soon basically um but we're just getting ready for the beach club chloe looks fabulous thank don't you so do you we're literally matching thank you i know i love that we always try and be like oh let's do like some kind of photos coordinated but we don't even have to plan because we just know the color palettes are going to be similar so we've gone yeah. for a very similar like crochet, crochet. vibe i've gone dark very mykonos i've gone black swan and you've gone golden swan oh that was that tiktok what the black swan one where it's like black swan and golden swan oh that'd be quite fun it. to do that could be lost da primeira vez que eu te vi menina meu coração this is just so amazing we've all got our own little bed we've just got some rosé here as well which i'm helping myself do i think we might order some lunch in a bit but it's just so relaxing so chilled it is honestly such a dream. I'm just looking out to the sea where everyone's swimming. There's little doggies here too, which I love. Oh, what a vibe. I'm running super late so I'm gonna be really quick here but we're off to Scorpios and I've got my linen dress from River Island on really wish I had time to iron or steam it but alas it's been a quick turnaround from the beach club and I've done a bit of a brown smoky eye as well to match my Amazon earrings so trusty and I've just popped a little earring on an Astrid and Miu necklace but alas we've got to get going because I'm running so late let's go <laughs> you guys are gonna laugh at my boat trip outfit i keep seeing and i'm not too sure if i'm pulling it off i'm not gonna lie these like vintage style head scarves on people and i'm obsessed with it and i think it's going to be really good protection from the sun i just i don't know i think maybe with the shirt it's too much <laughs>
perfect spot for vlogging. But um, my gosh, I have so much to catch you all up on and zero time to catch you up. But tonight, if you can believe it or not, it's actually our last night here at Nomad Hotel. And then me and Chloe have extended our trip and we're gonna be doing another two days, um, two or three days actually. I think it's a full weekend in Mykonos. Relaxing, just vibing. So excited, little girls break. Decompressing the works. And then we're actually off on a caramelin trip at Mykonos. So it's full steam ahead. And I cannot believe how lucky, like how lucky we have been here. Caudalie have absolutely spoiled us. We've had the most incredible experiences that I would never get. So I do feel beyond lucky to be doing any of this stuff. I'm so grateful to the team. So tonight being our last night is a bit bittersweet because it's we've had an amazing time, but no one's coming to an end. Um, and I, sorry, I feel like I haven't actually picked up my camera enough. I'll try and do it a lot more when it's just me and Chloe, but I never want to pick up my camera and be rude, so I'm trying to talk to everyone, but I'm trying to pick it up, and I can either do a voiceover or put some music over, so you guys are still coming along, you're still getting the vibe with everything, but today's the last night, we're going to a restaurant called Zuma, and I popped on these like fresh water pearl earrings, these are from Arquette, Arquette do beautiful accessories by the way, um, and I've got this like silk flowy maxi dress from costs on as well so very Mykonos themed I feel and I'm so excited to go see the girls and have last drinks of the trip <laughs> new location me and chloe checked into here yesterday and i'll be completely honest with you we had a late night we had a super late night so yesterday was kind of like a slothy raw day if you know what i mean and we got actually quite lucky with the weather because the weather was super gloomy so it meant that we didn't feel bad for having like a chill day so we checked in here about three ish i think we checked in here around three um and yeah we just relaxed and we basically our own little private villa it's got a little pool outside it's really cute um so yesterday we just chilled i didn't want to pick up here she is i feel like you haven't even properly been on the vlog yet i have not this morning i was like have you got fur rose no Holiday. under no circumstance i feel like when you're in your 30s you guys will know especially when you're 30 you're fine it's when you hit 32 which i am you're approaching the mids people Not don't understand i'm 32 young. my body doesn't feel it that's for sure <laughs> my god yesterday was rough but regardless we're in me yeah, the glow is so happened. happy the glow up has happened nobody understands real pain unless you have to fake tan on a hangover oh that was agony but we're literally gonna go to a beach club just now are we going to the same one yeah because it's yeah. just down the road it's literally we're going to the same one because it was a really good vibe it's a five minute walk and then later on we're actually going to go to the old town isn't it so that we can kind of mm -hmm. like See a little bit more of making us itself which will be nice and obviously you guys will come with us and you're vlogging a bit more today as well aren't you I'm trying yeah she's gonna try and vlog a little bit as well so you'll get two vlogs of the same trip so that means all of the content possible is it how are you uh, how are you finding the hat in the wind humbled humbled every five seconds humbled. can you I believe this we could ride with these guys but they're going the opposite direction it is a jeep so i would be happy with that but also safety first chloe's a little rebel oh. i love the greeks Oh, I mean, could you tell? She did marry one. It's also funny on her story, she uploaded a picture of a Greek man that was picking oh us up. Everyone. And literally everyone was like, Wait, did you see the old man? Yeah, no, bless. <laughs> and I look so, there's just two girls being extra, extra, like look what we're wearing in the middle of a sandy road, in the middle of the wilderness. I did you safety today, put the heavy artist on. She chose safety, guys. This is safety. <laughs> it is, but then we've got sunnies, earrings, hat, the lot. But look where we are, isn't this just so beautiful? We bed because I said if we bought this 20 minutes. Yeah, we're probably not. I mean, it's a Saturday, isn't it? Oh, yeah, sorry. Let's get actual B roll. Right, go. Here she is. Oh, elegance. Oh, no, don't follow. Don't chase. She's too. Oh, yeah, get my views up, girl.
Bravo cam. Cheers, Bob. Cheers. I don't know if you're gonna hear me over it, but it's full on golden hour. It's such a gorgeous setting. know about girls holiday is that when we and Chloe are away we try and put our outfits out from the night before if that makes to try and help some of the creasing and everything because you know if you're living in a case it's a nightmare so Chloe's got her outfit here you can make a little rope top and trousers from under the stories she's been repping under the stories and I've been repping a bit more River Island and this is a bit of a silk satiny set that I've got kind of pajama vibe but you know guys I love that this top is from Marks and Spencer's and I love it I think it's very Greek if that makes sense so I'm tempted to wear that today as well and then Chloe's got another under their stories number here which is really pretty so we've got them all out hoping we don't have to steam too many I need to get ready I've still got wet hair and we've just been chilling by the pool all morning but it's time to get on with our day Side note, tell me you're on holiday without telling me you're on holiday. Why are these so good? Could I pick them up from the like local supermarket and look, have, look at the damage? And a lot of that is me. They're just so flipping good. I feel like on holiday I'm really rubbish at eating. Like I just eat crap all the time. And lots of snacks, lots of ice cream, lots of desserts, like all the bad stuff. Because I'm just like, ugh, live your truth. But these ones, these are so good with the... Lay's crisp and a Fanta lemon. Mm. Today's our last day here in this villa, so we really wanted to just like take it quite slow because tomorrow will be a little bit more hectic. And then we're going to go back into the old town because we've obviously only seen it, well, I don't know if it's the old town, like the main town. Um, we've only seen it during the evening. So we're going to go in the day and kind of check Shop. it out, do a little bit of shopping and have a look at the bars and the food and everything like that and then i think we'll probably have not like an early checkout but we do have a checkout probably like 11 um and then we need to think about what we're gonna do because we're actually not going to the next villa and meeting the caramel and team until around four so wish us luck but i've not put anything on my eyes today because they're feeling a bit tender i don't know if you ever feel like this when you're on a holiday i think it's the sun and the wind and everything but if I'm putting on mascara every day, taking it off, oh, my eyes, it absolutely hates it. So I woke up a little bit puffy today. So I'm gonna have a no mascara day because I'm probably just gonna put my sunnies on anyway. So, point. Just ordered a couple of coffees. What did you get, Bob? I got a frappe. Delish. What is that? Because like, I didn't really know that. It's basically like a Greek coffee. The way they do it is they like whisk it up so it makes it like really like, it's like an ice cream in a way, like frothy. Mm, that's what I want. Yeah. I think your water's coming yeah, as well. Yeah. Lovely. Got to stay hydrated as well, guys. It's absolutely roasting out here. Thank you. Thanks so much. This looks so good. This is exactly what I wanted. Never before have I been so excited about something in all my life. I can confirm the frappes are oh, amazing. Domination. Yeah. Bye. My friend. The mission was here last night. So cute. Aww. They molt so much. The Yeah, my ex had one in it. Like, as soon as it goes in the bed, it's a bit like labs as well. Yeah. Labs are surprisingly. Yeah. But anyway, <laughs> probably is really good for some of having one. Mm. How frothy it is at the top. <laughs> I mean, we're just having like nibbles together. I think we're heading back to the Dior store, aren't ya? Oh, glasses on. I should be buying. She's had a few little sparkling wines and now she's like. Yeah, every time you show me, I feel like it's like a drunk. Well, you know, the camera never lies. We are heading off 
and we're gonna see if she wants the earrings that she's had her eyes on. They're so pretty. Very honeymoon esque, I must admit. Mm, no, she hasn't got the honeymoon. Not yet, but soon. The eggs. I'm gonna try the eggs. Okay. Okay. has come to do the last ever room vlog from Vitilia Black Villas. That's where we're staying, by the way. We would recommend it if you're just looking for something very chill, low-key, maybe for a couple of days, but you are very far out, so you have to pay quite a bit for taxis back and forth. Just a little tip. And the taxis in Mykonos are really expensive. Like, we've been 50 euros each time. So, Keep that in mind if you're traveling to Mykonos and if you want to book something a bit further out it will be costing you but it is worth it in terms of like the peace and quiet and the views and everything you get but we're checking out today and we've actually got a bit of time to kill before we head over to meet the team um at caramel and i'd like to know it and i think we're gonna find another well i booked this morning a lunch reservation at a nearby hotel um because we can just like pull up there have a coffee get some lunch relax there for a bit before coming back here because we're getting picked up back here. It's always when you're checking out of hotels, isn't it? And you don't really know what to do, whether you've got a flight later on or whatever. It's always a bit awkward because you've always got to come back for your luggage. Whew, I feel like I'm speaking a million hours an hour. But it's going to be really good because I love when you're on holiday going to like another location. I just love seeing hotels and everything. So looking forward to seeing the whole team. Everyone who's coming, there'll be a new group of girls. And yeah, just seeing what kind of room they've got. Back. chicken club sandwich was so good. I feel like it's one of those things you've got to have when you're on holiday. And I've got myself a little Coke Zero now from a glass bottle, which I think makes all the difference. If you're not on holiday right now, pour yourself Coke Zero and have a little refreshing drink with me. <laughs> This is sensational! How stunning! We've just arrived at our villa and I don't think we can express just how luxurious this villa is. It's absolutely gorgeous and look at all the cute little bits we've got! Like, no touch is undone. I love the popper. Okay, this is all so excited. And we've even got our little itinerary here for the full set. And then, I mean, look, even got ourselves a little fan. So me and Claire are staying in this bed. Span over, we've got a little swimwear, a drink, do makeup, and then look at these views. I mean, this is the best trip of my life. I mean, is this my honeymoon? Probably. Look at that. I mean, I know I did show you a little bit, but such a good bunch. And then we've got the sea, and then the piece de resistance. Let me show you. Me and Chloe have been kindly kitted out with for the weekend. Look at all of this. Oh my gosh, it's so exciting. I cannot wait. There's so much fun bits to try on. I don't even know where to like start with everything, to be honest. It all looks... So gorge. We put the nicest little treats on our bed as well, like water bottle, little cameras, which are all branded, which is so sweet of them. Fans, our itinerary. We've got such a lovely itinerary whilst we're here. Let me show you. So I've already shown you the top. Let me go down to the bottom. Look at the like aesthetics and the design of this. Me and Chloe have our own little like, it's almost like a little castle. It's like a little turret. It's very cute. We are keeping the honeymoon themes alive got a little breakfast area out here where we could just sit, have a little chin wag, absolutely love it. Got all of our little bits and bobs here and then we come through here and I think this is like a bathroom. How cool is this like little cave design? Ah, we've got kitchen, fridge, another bathroom here. It's just very cool. I feel very lucky to be here and we've got so much exciting bits from Caramel and to kind of try on. We've got a poolside get together now. So I guess I better get out of what I'm wearing. 
and get into some fun outfits. <laughs> the worst breakdown of the outfit ever but this is the outfit it is giving French River I swear I don't know what's happening to my style I feel like I'm getting very vintage and I don't even realize it but this is the vibe I absolutely love the cardigan I seen a girl on Pinterest Pinterest if I can find it I'll find the image and she had like this cardigan style over a swimsuit and I just thought it looked really chic so I want to try and replicate and like guys we need to be sun safe so I've gone very sun safe with the hat, but I just think it's a very cool look all together, but we're just gonna get back, refresh the makeup again. <laughs> you know the drill, try on an outfit and figure out what it is we're gonna wear tonight. We are just giving turn around after turn around. Oh, I think there's something on you two seconds. Oh, I don't know if I made that worse. And um, we're just giving turn around after turn around. <laughs> Me and Chloe have very similar matching outfits on, which is actually quite cool. All white. And tonight we're doing a kind of like private dinner of fresco outside, which will be lovely. I should, we should actually get some bug spray. Oh yeah. I feel like this is when the mosquitoes are going to be for sure. Um, but yeah, we have very similar outfits on all white off the shoulder, floor length. So very bougie, which is quite cool. I quite like dressing up when you're in a villa because it means like you're not going to town and struggling. Like you're literally just going over. So I think that'll be easy. But I've just done full face again. My skin has never known so much tension in all of its life. You guys know me, I don't really wear that much makeup on the day to day and it's only when I'm going out, but we've been piling it on, so I'm hoping. I mean, it's been well behaved so far, so let's see. But again, going with the Amazon earrings, these guys have just been a classic. And I absolutely love this outfit. We don't have a full length mirror in this room, so I'll show you when we go up. But Chloe looks gorgeous as well, let me show you. Does she look gorge? So beautiful. I feel like it's giving like Sophia Richie energy. I absolutely love it. Also just laughing at the absolute state of our room. We're actually quite clean. Yeah. But it's just been chaos. So don't mind. I feel like every girl knows this situation when they're getting ready together. It's just always all over the place. Tell me you're on a content trip without telling me you're on a content trip. All the girls are getting sunset hour with a tripod and I love it. And then here's little Chloe. And she is going to try and get us a little solo dancey one which will be really cute makes it look like within a second you've gotten ready and I so wish that was the truth and I so wish it wasn't as hard as it was I think at this point my skin is screaming at me but we're not done we've still got tonight and I'm gonna do bare minimal makeup tomorrow but this is a look I wish we had a full length mirror to show you but it's very rat and boa inspired which I love it's a caramelin slip dress wrap combo and this is bold for me it's like it looks animal print but i think it's more like abstract um and i'm wearing my trusty hat as well oops i cut you off um and then i've got a little rose bikini underneath which is really cool so this is very extra but i'm into it i'm gonna see if we can get some little pics today um i do have a second outfit as well that's more like lunch appropriate less beachy um so yeah it's gonna be really good very excited to have another day by the beach soaking all up because this will be the last beach day i'm gonna have in a while so i really need to just enjoy i feel like i need to show you all the girls because everyone's dressed up and looks so amazing i was saying this to the girls i absolutely love when i go on holiday with um influencers and stuff because you get the best inspiration for outfits and also i'm normally the dressed up one so it's so nice to be with your people but let me show you Look at everyone. Do they not just look so cute? 
I love seeing everyone all dressed up. It's the cutest. final night guys we've made it to the end of the Mykonos journey I'm gonna be really quick obviously we're in all Karen Millen and I've gone for a bit of a vintage look I, I mean it's so windy out here this side of the island is crazy windy um, so this hair is gonna fall out kind of already is but we're gonna have a nice drink outside with everyone I feel like it's such a good group so we're gonna have delicious food yummy drink Chloe looks so cute She's all in blue. Here she is. Ready with the tripod. I'm ready to get some content before we sit down. I actually just thought I'd say goodbye to the vlog now. Because we're actually, this is our very last morning. We're just going back into the kind of town centre. And I have no idea if I'd get a chance to say goodbye to you guys again. If we've got extra footage, I'll pop some extra footage in. But most likely not, so. I want to say thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. I know you guys like the travel vlogs and coming with us on our girls' trip. And I will see you guys next.